Hello, this is Sam Pollock, student number 10127960. I'm going to be showing off my mobile midterm. Um, so let's start by taking a look at it running in the simulator. The assignment was to change a, a top down shooter to a, or a portrait shooter to a landscape shooter. And mission accomplished. So now let's take a look and how we accomplished it. So here it is. It, it, there was some, some repositioning of assets in the scene, but the bulk of the magic happened in these three scripts here. Uh, oh, sorry, four scripts here. Um, so first off, we have the player, and then I just need to grab some stuff and change some Floats. I, I renamed them to be a little clearer, um, oh, or clearer and more accurate for the for the new orientation. And then in these transforms and these world positions, yeah, uh, prior these were looking for X position and we're changing the X position. Um, now as the as the player is moving up and down, it's going for the Y position. Um, and it's and using a, the, that. Are the correct axis on these input axes. Um, and then the check bounds is also taking a look at these vertical boundaries instead of the horizontal ones. Um, the bullets need to undergo a similar change. Um, so here they're going instead of up to down, they're going left to right, so we're using a horizontal speed here. And finally, the, the enemies, uh, instead of bouncing left to right, they need to be bouncing up and down uh, to dodge the player's attacks. And again, it's just a matter of checking these different boundaries and use, and they're transforming them along the y-axis instead of the x. And, and again, here it is in the simulator. And of course, stuff like the lives and text label uh, don't, didn't need to undergo any change at all because of um, they were they were anchored, and so when it was once I enabled the switching, oh, which by the way happened here in player settings, uh, the resolution of presentation needs to enable landscape right instead of the portrait orientation for the build. Um, I was planning on jumping in and taking care of the bonus portions of this midterm, but I ended up dedicating all of my time and attention to the assignment, um, which was submitted just a few minutes prior to this. So I hope you enjoy taking a look at both. All right, thanks. This was Sam Pollock, one zero one and something something, one zero one two seven nine six one zero one two seven nine six zero eight. Okay, thanks, Tom.